My name is architect Dr. Ruben Musioka Mutiso. I turned 72 years a week ago. I joined AAK after graduation. I graduated in 1974. I was in the class of 74. 1975, I got registered as an architect, but joined AAK uh, 1978. Now, um, it has been quite a journey, and um, uh, at first, I was in public service. I was chief architect, East African Post and Telecommunications, and Kenya Post and Telecommunications. 1981, I got out into practice. I founded the practice Tectura International, which has got uh, a Pan-African network. We are in very many countries in Africa. We are in South Africa, we are in Botswana, we are in Namibia, we are in Zambia, we are in East Africa. And so my practice is, is fairly wide and I'm the chairman. What have I learned about the profession um, um, I've learned first that it's very important to build uh, a network of, uh, of clients, people who depend on, people who trust you, uh, uh, people who can consult on you, even on some minor and small projects, but big projects as well. We work largely for the government, for governments where we are. Uh, and uh, so what I've learned is to walk the straight and the narrow in the profession, being a person who can be trusted. Now, where would I want, how do I see the profession moving for the generations to come? Uh, we are living in times that are very fast. Technology has taken over. Um, information is uh, is is very available. We used to use uh, manuals and journals. These days that's not uh, necessary. You'll you be found uh, strange uh, to be using such. So uh, I, I, I want the profession to be at a point where uh, people are ready to meet the challenges of the day by being properly informed and knowing where information can be found and um, looking even at the past, because the past informs architecture. And the future will depend on the present as well. So I would want a profession that is relevant, that addresses the needs of the people, a profession that listens, listens and interprets people's needs after listening, not through imposition of uh, their own ideals or what they think is best. That's where I would want the profession to be. Exciting times, they are, but um, you can't be left behind and Kenya will not be left behind and uh, that's where I would want the profession to be. Right?